So this, this is just a quick review of this salt dog tailgate spreader. Um, I've run about a 125 50 pound bags through it. And the salt spreader itself, I actually really like this little salt spreader. I mean, it was cheap, so it was just under $700. So there's definitely things that could be better about it, but the salt spreader itself, I'm pretty pleased with. Uh, one thing that could be done differently is this right here, this uh, salt deflector is just cheap crap. So if you back into any snow, snow at all, it just bends it the heck, which I did another video where I put that fascia on there to help keep some of that salt from piling up on the bumper because without having these pieces on here it really it just piles up on the bumper and it I don't know yeah that so that salt deflector is pretty crappy but other than that this spreader I'm pretty pleased with it um, the thing that I I'm not pleased with is the controller that comes with it. So this controller this controller right here in my opinion this controller is crap. Um, it has to go through that whole cycle before you can actually use it. And then if you run it on anything higher than a one, you literally just blow the salt out and, and pretty much a pile. I mean, you literally have to run it on one or you're just wasting your salt. I plow a couple HOAs and big parking lots and stuff like that. So I use the salt spreader in commercial in a commercial setting and on those HOAs the first time I used the spreader I had it set on like three and I just blew through way too much salt and uh, yeah so this this controller in my opinion is complete garbage but the salt spreader I'm very pleased with the salt spreader I just hate the controller and that pretty much is a wrap for this review on this little salt dog tailgate spreader.